Hi guys, in this video I am going to discuss about nested while loop. The definition is one loop inside another loop is called nested loop. So right here, this is one while loop and inside one more while loop. So it's called nested while loop. So this is the syntax. First while expression statement. Here you can write another while inside if statements and uh, this is statements for um, upper while loop so this is the example i'm gonna discuss so i've taken two header file first is a standard input output header file so right here i'm using printf function so this function definition written inside of stdr dot h header file and uh, printf is a predefined uh, function and get chl is also a predefined function so the definition of get search function written inside of conny.h header file now next uh, what main function so main function this is the entry so here after or uh, that comes to this point here i've taken uh, two integer type variable int i and int J. Both are in this range with one, one, and I used clear screen function. So the use of clear screen function to terminate previous output screen. Now here while. So while check the condition one less than equal to two condition true. So if the condition true, then that will comes to inner while loop here. Check the condition J less than equal to 10 j value is now 1 1 less than equal to 10 condition true so it comes to this point at here first print here, percent or d because at here the value of ij is integer tab i and j integer so that i used percent so that will uh, print the value value of i and j so 1 into 1 output 1 here after j gonna increase by 1 j become 2 now again after increasing the value com control comes to this point check the condition 2 or uh, less than equal to 10 condition 2 here go inside this term 2 into 1 i value is now 1 and 2 1 into 2 2 so that print 2 now here after again increase the value of j, uh, j. so j become 1 2 to 3 again that or uh, check the condition 3 less than 10 condition true so here go inside 1 into 3 print 3 and uh, j gonna increase by 1 j become 4 and uh, 4 less than 10 again that go inside and here that print 1 into 4 4 and here again increase the value of uh, j j become 5 and uh, check the condition 5 less than 10 again that go inside here uh, that return 1 into 5 5 and again increase the value of j j become 6 check the condition 6 less than equal to 10 then that go inside and again that uh, 1 into 6 the output 6 again increase the value of j j becomes 7 check the condition 7 less than 10 come into inside here 1 into 7 output 7 again uh, j gonna increase by 8 j become 8 so check the condition 8 less than 10 condition 2 then that will go inside 1 into 8 8 again increase the value of j so j become 9 go up 9 less than 10 condition true 
print 1 into 9 or 9 again uh, that go up uh, sorry here increase the value of j so j become 10 or go up 10 or uh, check the condition 10 less than equal to 10 condition true then again go inside 1 into 10 output 10 again that gonna increase the j value j become 11 check the condition 11 is so uh, available less than equal to 10 condition not true so here yeah, that comes to this point here yeah, i gonna increase by 1 so i become 2 and hereafter that go up and check the condition 2 less than equal to 2 condition true then that go inside here yeah, check the condition y of j less than equal to 10 so j value is now 11 11 less than equal to 10 so that now go inside here i gonna increase by 1 so i become 2 to 3 again that go up take, uh, check the condition 3 less than equal to 2 condition not true so that will go out of while loop control comes to this point get search function here that will take one input from keyword and terminate the output screen so in this bit i discussed about the way of execution of while loop in c programming so i hope guys you understand i simply uh, displayed 1 to 10 by using nested while loop so i hope guys you understand the logic of this program so thanks for watching see you next video